Hey guys, it's Ashley, your Scrapping Nerd, and I have a 12 by 12 layout today. It's a Disney themed, and so I used a bunch of my Disney stash. So this is Echo Park, um, Remember the Magic, this one, sticker book, Say Cheese, Main Street, and then the sticker sheet is a Magical Place by Echo Park. And then I cut out these um, Mickey ears with my Cricut that I made. And all the papers are from a Simple Stories paper pad. So they're only um, single sided. And it's the Say Cheese 4 paper pad. And I just love all the patterns and the things they say. So I decided I needed to use them all on this layout. So first I'm going to start because I'm going to be ripping the papers so I need a base and so I have kind of a stack of papers that are not my favorite and so I use them um, as backer papers or scraps and so I'll flip this page over just so I know what the 12 by 12 size is and then I'm going to take each of these papers and rip them and I'm gonna rip strips and then I'm going to lay them diagonal and so I decided to rip them because I'm not good at diagonals and I'm not good with triangles and so if I rip them then if it's a little wonky it looks like I meant for it to be that way so I um, took that one which was the polka dots and then this one that has the balloons I'm just gonna rip the corner and that'll be my top corner and then the red one um, that just has a lot of sayings like magical memories fun hooray this one will be my bottom corner. So I don't even have to worry about getting the angles right for the corners. And then this main one that I have the biggest piece for is just uh, very busy. It's happy, fun, magic, um, and very colorful. But I ripped that one along the diagonals and I left the corners of that so that it evens with the 12 by 12 paper but it's still ripped and looked and looks kind of distressed and then when I had them all on top of each other they blended a little bit so I took some of my Tim Holtz distress ink and just inked the edges a little it's not very dark it just a little subtlety to separate them and because of the ears being black I figured I could add some black in there and so the ears I just took um, circles on my Cricut and I made the Mickey head and then had two smaller circles for the ears and welded them together and then I cut it out three times and it's not perfect circles I didn't want this um, to be perfect so it's kind of just like a sketchy circle um, design and then I have them a little offset from each other and I couldn't offset them too much otherwise it stopped looking like the Mickey ears and then with my photo I wanted to add uh, photo mats to them so I first did the yellow stars and then I'll distress that and the second one is the blue um, with like the white diamond like stars and those served as kind of a solid on my background to separate all the pattern like the busy pattern papers and so it works to help separate the photo from the background as well because that main piece that goes through the middle is pretty busy and I distressed them so that it still looks kind of just like a rustic distress since I ripped my pages for the background. And I did that for both of the photo mats. So I'll get that done and laid down there. And I really like the photo off on the corner. And so I'm going to glue the bottom down there so that my Mickey ears stay... Um, in the way that I want them to. I didn't want them to keep moving around, so I kind of glued them together in this offset pattern here. And then I am gonna start working on my embellishment clusters, and so this banner says magical, and that came from the sticker sheet. And then I'll put this little camera here. My, I'm gonna put only embellishment clusters around the photo. Since my background is so busy, I actually didn't put as many embellishment clusters that I usually do on a page. And so I liked this blue sticker strip. It says magic is in the air. It kind of just created a shelf down there for um, my camera and then the balloons there on the side of it. 
And then um, from the simple stories, I put that fun down there um, underneath the the banner. I think it's coming up here. It is. And um, that, so that's my title, Magical Fun. And the fun came from that Simple Stories pack. I think that's the only thing that I used from the Simple Stories sticker pack was that from the title. And then all these sayings that I'm going to put up on the right of the picture. The red one says fun this way. The black one says adventure. The yellow one says the best day ever. And the white one says fantasy. And you know, it just adds a little fun to the picture over there. And then these fireworks, the, so we're standing in front of the Walt Disney and Mickey statue that's at the end of Main Street. And so you can kind of see the castle in the background, but not too much. And so there's a lot of the sky. And so I thought these fireworks would be cute to just fill in the sky there. And I will pop those up on a layer of craft adhesive foam so that there's a little bit of dimension. And I put these little sticker hearts in the middle of the fireworks. And it just adds something to that kind of blank space of the that the sky has. And then I'll do just some scattering around. Here's some yellow and uh, I think there'll be some blue stars that I'll put in the sky there. These little hearts I'll put underneath the fantasy word. Um, the saying on the camera says, check this out with a little arrow. You know, just some little embellishments surrounding the photo. And then I realized my top layer wasn't as, of the Mickey ears wasn't as glued down. So I don't want that to catch in my album. So I'm just adding some more glue to that. And the Mickey ears turned out good. I wasn't sure how this would look. And the like I said, they're just welded together on the Cricut. So it's not a perfect Mickey ear here. It's just kind of like a sketchy look. And it actually turned out really good. I really like it. Um, so I decided I wanted to add some Mickey heads, but I didn't have any in any other colors but black so I took some enamel dots and made some I used the bigger ones for like the head and two smaller ones for the ears so it just adds some yellow glittery Mickey ears around the uh, the title and so I really liked how that looked and so that's the layout thank you to everyone who has subscribed to my channel I really appreciate it if you haven't liked and subscribed yet go ahead and hit those buttons and thank you everyone have a good day bye